Hey, what's going on guys? Tammy Koki here. Today I'm going to teach you how to make a poster. It is pretty simple. I think you'll like it. Um, so yeah, let's get to it. So first things first, um, I have already made a PSD file. I will attach it below. And it pretty much has all of these images that I'm going to use in there. These are the three things that I use for this poster. All right, so first things first, we are going to take this woman out of the background. So we're gonna use our um, quick selection tool and you, we're gonna click on selected mask. Make sure that your view mode is on overlay and make sure that the opacity is about 50%. So what that does is that as I'm selecting her, I can actually see what I am selecting. Um, you don't have to worry about her earrings for this one. Um, I don't think I had it on the other one. I'm gonna press OK. Oh, I did have it. Okay. Um, let me go back and do our selected mask. And I'm gonna zoom in and we're just going to, you know, do our best to select the earrings as best as we can. I'm just gonna leave it like this. If you press OK, um, make sure your output is actually to selection and then you press OK. So now we have the lady. I'm gonna take her out of the back. I'm gonna right click it and say layer via copy. I'm gonna hide this layer. This is the lady. I'm gonna use my black and white filter. I'm gonna make her black. And since if you look at the original image, she has some red tones on her face, so I can actually reduce the red and make her a little bit darker here. So that's exactly what I did. Secondly, um, I went in and I did the same thing for the fish. Photoshop actually has a select subject, which means that Photoshop would do its best to actually capture the subject um, for whatever layer is selected. And it does a pretty good job. So now that we have this selected, I'm gonna right click and say layer rate copy. And now we have our fish just like that, all right? Now, of course, we have the cloud as the background. So here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna first place this woman where I need her to be. Okay, now her body's here. And here we go. I'm gonna use a layer mask to kind of hide parts of the fish. All right? Okay. So I kind of get a feel of what I want. Okay, now I'm gonna use my pen tool and I'm just gonna try to make like a nice shape like this, okay? And then I'm going to use my layer mask and I'm going to erase that. All right, so we kind of have this on the lady. All right, so I'm gonna probably move it somewhere around here like this, okay? Now, I'm going to make a copy of this. I'm going to put it on her head as well. All right. So it's hard to recreate it verbatim. However, I'm going to do the best that I can. I'm going to take this off so we can actually see her. So this is kind of what I had. Put a layer mask here. And I kind of had this like on her face just like this, something like that, all right? And then I zoom in and I use my layer mask to kind of hide some parts, all right? And then I did something like this. And then I can also make it smaller so that the edges can actually fit like that. And there we go. You can also make a copy and put it behind and you can you know you can make it bigger or smaller whatever you want but I think I just like having one okay now of course you can see the uh, Photoshop did not really do a great job eliminating these parts of it so I can just go in here and take them off if I want to you do not have to Right, um, 
and now I'm going to show you guys how I did my background it's fairly simple I have the sky just right here what I'm going to do is I'm going to make a new layer bring it to the bottom make sure it's on top of the sky and I'm going to use my gradient tool and I kind of already have the shape I want I mean the color I want it's kind of like a brownish to blue and I'm just going to go from the middle to the top uh, actually let me go down and I'm just going to click on um, difference Oops. clicking on difference kind of gives me this cool effect you can flip it however you'd like um, whatever whatever way you want now with her fins I can go in here I can change the color all right so I think I kind of had something like this for her head yeah I did all right and then for her fin I kind of had a different color as well so you can make a copy of that clip it and you can also give her the same color or something lighter all right and that is pretty much how that poster was made of course I already um, I've already done this a couple of times um, so I'm kind of going a little bit fast so I'm not it doesn't look too perfect um, but yeah this is pretty much how this was made if you want the blend to look more realistic you can definitely just um, go to your layer mask and just um, mess with the blending just a little all right so here you go if you want to move all of her to the top or more so to the middle you just click on all the layers press command t and it moves them all together and here we go and if you decide you don't like the color and you want to change the colors later on you can do that if you want to just have it all black you can do that as well but i kind of like this if you have any questions please leave them in the comments below goodbye